okay let's get started so in this first video i want to show you how you can map your volume to the keys r t y and u so take note that you can use any letters to map your keys so now go to options and then controls and then you can go go to your key lane and then i want to start with the letter u i'm gonna map that to level plus two percent my y to level minus two minus two percent my my R to level zero percent level zero percent and then my my T to eleven hundred percent. So you can now save your settings and then let's test them. So Currently now I'm not recording my keyboard, but as I press my U, you can see that the volume is increasing. And as I press my Y, you can see that the volume is decreasing. I press my T, it goes straight to 100%. Press my R, it goes straight to 0%. Now let's move to our next video whereby we will be um, mapping um, the filter controls to our keyboard. Okay, we are done with the volume. Now let's map our field. I'm gonna use the keys Z, X, A, and D to map my field. So let's start Z, and then I'm gonna map that to. I'm gonna map that to um, filter. I'm gonna map that to filter. What the hell? I'm gonna map that to filter filter minus one percent then when I map my x to fill to fill to fill filter plus one percent then my a to to filter my A to filter 50% filter 50% and then my D to filter 0% so save and then let's test it As I press my Z now, can you see? And then as I press my X, can you see? And then if I press my A, it takes my filter straight to 50%. And then if I press my D, it takes the filter to 0%. Now let's move to the next video where I will be looking at loops. Most of the times when I DJ on Visual DJ, I like to use loops. So the things that you're gonna be mapping are this in and out button. So I'm gonna map those to the keys Q and W. So let's go to options, controllers, then Q. I'm gonna map Q to loop underscore in and then W to loop underscore out then save let's test them play the song as i press my q you will see that the in button will be highlighted check then as i press my w you'll see that the button out will be highlighted and then now forms a loop that's it let's move to our last video where i will be looking at eq 
with EQ there's only one thing that I want to show you which is killing the base of the song so we're gonna map our K key to the knob to the to this low knob so go to your options controllers and then K K EQ underscore kill underscore low then save then listen as I play my song press the K did you hear that um, this this is our final video so one last trick that I want to show you is that sometimes like um, when you have your lob you, when you have your knob like somewhere around here or there then you want to take it back to 0% so what you'll have to just do is to double click the knob then it will just go straight to 0% you see and then uh, if you found this videos helpful please don't forget to subscribe